Hey guys, good afternoon. It's one o'clock. I almost said good morning. Oh man, where is the day gone? It's actually kind of gone kind of fast, kind of slow. I don't really know. Oh my gosh, I just arrived. <laughs> anyway, today we are doing family pictures with my side of the family. So originally we were going to do family pictures um, and my mom was going to get one blown up and put in our house for my brother's wedding, but Porter ended up getting COVID and so um, he couldn't do the wedding and all that and so that got scrapped. So now we uh, rescheduled it and we're doing like a photo session. We're using the same photographer that I used back in the summer when I did our family pictures and we're gonna go to like the same location um, but obviously it's gonna look different because we did ours in the summer and this is fall almost winter um, and so we're gonna do family pictures we have like a whole color scheme I've got outfits ready for everybody uh, the boys are napping right now that's why it's actually quiet <laughs> so I will try and vlog a little bit of the pictures if I'm not in any of them the one downside is I don't know why we scheduled it today, but we waited until the last Sunday of November to do these pictures. Um, I think my mom was just like, oh, we'll just do it the Sunday of Thanksgiving weekend. Everybody will be in town and we can just do it then. Well, that's great in theory, but it is freezing today. It's a high of... 39 yeah it's 39 out it's cloudy and the worst is it's windy it's very windy today so i went out earlier to get gas because my car was low so i would have enough gas to get to this place and back and i was freezing just standing there pumping my gas so we are going to be freezing we've got the two littles with us our little kids they are not going to be happy about it we're going to bring coats to wear like in off pictures um and i'll bring a blanket but I don't know why we did pictures this late in the year. It just next time we need to do summer family pictures because I do not like these winter fall ones. So we'll see how it goes. Um, and then I think afterwards, I think we're going to go to my parents' house and have pizza and just hang out. So I'll vlog a little bit if I don't like freeze my fingers off. Um, but I think I'm going to tell my mom after this no more winter pictures because this is horrible. <laughs> this weather is just nasty. And of course, like the next couple Sundays, it's supposed to be nice and like 40s, mid 40s. And this one, it's like freezing and windy. It wouldn't be so bad if it was sunny and not windy, but it's neither of those things. <laughs> So we'll see. I have about a million shoes laid out here. Those are my shoes I'm gonna wear, but I don't know what I'm gonna put the boys in. So I just grabbed a bunch of shoes. I have their outfits picked out. So for our family, our color scheme, we're gonna do, it's like green, burnt orange, yellow, and cream and brown. So I'm in a cream dress. Anthony's in a burnt orange shirt. And he's just gonna wear jeans. Grayson's in a cream like sweater and like burnt orange pants and then Porter is in a green sweater and khakis so that's what we're wearing um, I don't know what everyone else is wearing we've been shopping like all weekend to try to find outfits for everyone so it's gonna be freezing hopefully we get some good pictures I mean most of us are adults so I mean we can smile and pose and do great it's just gonna be the little kids that it's give or take if they're gonna cooperate or not. But we've worked with this photographer before. We've gotten pictures of the boy smiling. Um, so the photographer knows how to work with kids. She has a kid of her own. So hopefully it goes well today. Hopefully we can just get it done fast. I think she said the sessions are usually about an hour long. So just have to get through an hour of cold. We'll see how it goes, but. I wish it was better weather, but that's what happens when you schedule on the last Sunday of November. It's freezing. It's like winter. So I'm going to tell my mom no more of these. Like I wish I, we could have done it a month ago, but my mom didn't want to make my brothers drive up from Cincinnati to take the pictures. It would have been a lot warmer a month ago. 
but I'm just complaining. <laughs> so I will try and vlog a little bit here and there. Uh, also, yesterday we hosted Anthony's family for Thanksgiving. It went really well. Um, Anthony and I hosted our second Thanksgiving, so I made my turkey. We tried a new recipe this year. I found it online. It's supposedly is called like the juiciest Thanksgiving turkey ever or something like that. And um, it calls for like herbs and spices and stuff. But the thing that made it different was you had to put a whole can of chicken broth in it or on top of it. And also, here's the kicker, a whole bottle of champagne. You put a whole bottle of champagne over it and then you get some in the cavity as well. So we tried it because we said every year we're going to try a different recipe until we find one that we love. And so we tried it and baked it and honestly it was really, really good. It was very juicy. Usually when I have turkey it's very dry and I do not like dry. This one was like very moist. I don't like that word. But it was very um, juicy. So it was great. I think we're going to keep that recipe. Weird that, you know, you put a whole bottle of champagne on it but obviously after cooking for like three and a half, four hours, like you don't taste it. Yeah, it was really good and we had had a good time just visiting I didn't really take videos or anything um, we were just enjoying the family time and then we just watched football so Thanksgiving is officially done we are in the Christmas season now um, I went Black Friday shopping with my mom and sisters on Black Friday and I got lots of gifts for the boys I got something for Anthony um, I got like $20 boots for me that was a pretty good deal and I don't know if I got anything else oh I got slippers it's not very exciting, but uh, yeah, I got some toys for the boys, which was really good. I have a couple more things that I need to get for Porter. I have a secret Santa I need to get something for, and then I want to get something else for Anthony. I'm almost checking everything off my list, so very exciting about that. It was super fun. We went all day shopping. It was tiring at the end, but it was so fun. I loved it. That was like my Christmas right there, because Anthony watched the kids all day, so I didn't have to take them with me. Last year, I had to take Porter, because he was only two months old, so I was still breastfeeding him. It was was miserable he was miserable we had to hold him all the time we had to switch off who was holding him I had to go in the car and breastfeed him all the time it was horrible I did not like that this year was so much better because both kids just stayed with Anthony all day but anyway I just feel like I have so much to t catch you up on and I've just been so busy with all the Thanksgiving stuff that I haven't had a chance to talk to you guys I hope you guys had a great Thanksgiving weekend I hope you guys ate lots of turkey I read this crazy fact on like uber facts or something on my Facebook and it said that the average person eats 3,000 calories on Thanksgiving. Did you eat that much? I don't know. I don't know if I <laughs> ate that much. Anthony and I tried to keep our portion small just because we are going to Jamaica in less than a month now. Crazy. So we're trying to keep in shape, but all that Thanksgiving food is just so tempting. It's just so yummy. So. Mm -hmm.